Is he still there? He's still right, Jack. He hasn't moved here. I don't think we need to get to that rock before the sun gets, gets us in our face. Get low, kid. Get low, kid. On this hunt, we spotted a giant black wildebeest, and we're going to try to get set up for the shot. All right, come on. He's got to stop, Dad Gummit. Wait for him to stop running. I don't know if he's going to stop. He should, he should. Just stick on him, stick on him. There you go, Keith. He's going to stop. He's going to stop. Okay, you're there. Yeah. How far is he? 438 yards. Looks like it's hit. Come on, come on. Keith, hit him again as soon as he stops. What a shot. <laughs> Holy smokes. What do you think of that? I've been waiting for a black wheel to be since last year. I mean, last year, remember that one was way out there just like this? Yeah. And the wind was blowing like crazy and I just missed it by inches. I didn't miss him. Well, that's 438 yards, partner. That's a hell of a shot. Not many people would do that. You'd rather be lucky than good. I said that before. Let's go have a look at Come it. Come on. <laughs> good man. Tail on him there, Bruce. Oh, beautiful. Look at that. <laughs> Ooh. I have been waiting a year to get my hands on one of these guys. This is a black wildebeest. Look at the boss on him. I mean, he's deep. He's just a cool looking animal. Look at the mane on him right here. <laughs> you know, the one thing that I have, I've, now that I've been here, I hunted last year and this year, the one thing that I'm finding out that if anybody comes here, they better be prepared. If they're going to rifle hunt, they better be prepared to air one out. Mm -hmm. I mean, what are the, like, average shot wise, what should you say somebody be, should be prepared to shoot distance wise? Well, you see, some of these animals, like the black wildebeest, likes the open plains, like the springbuck. So they like to keep their distance. So you need something that's going to shoot 400 yards. But then your other animals, your wildebeest and stuff, the blue wildebeest will stick more to the, the thicker terrain. So it, it varies, but we always say an average of about 250 is the sort of shot you'd take. So you get a big one like this. Yeah, this is a big one. I cannot believe the show he put on. Taking off front and he finally <laughs> stopped and gave me a shot. Like I said, I've been waiting a year to get my hands on one. Okay, so if somebody wants more information on Hunter Hills Safaris, give them uh, what, what do they need to do. Well, just, just basically go to our website. Start there. Uh, okay. HuntersHillsSafaris.co.za. And we'll have a direct link from our website right to... Bruce and Greg's website and uh, get a hold of them. This is this is phenomenal, just absolutely phenomenal. And what a cool looking animal! Well, well done on that shot, Keith. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I got lucky again.